Alright guys, this is DocM with another Minecraft video and in episode 45 of DocM77's new Minecraft World Tour I quickly talked about a batch file I was using to allocate more memory or RAM to Minecraft. Um, it has two advantages. First of all it should prevent this yeah, Minecraft running out of memory crash and secondly it can but listen, it can, it's not a guarantee, improve FPS in some cases. For me it helped a bit, but it's not like a guaranteed success. But you could give it a shot because it's really simple to do. So everything you have to do is basically, or all you have to do is open up a new text file with your um, text editor. I use WordPad here and type in the following line. There we go. I'm assigning 4 gigabytes of RAM now. If you want to change that, you just uh, divide or multiply by 2 and that um, applies to two, both of those numbers. So if we wanted to align let's say 2 gigabytes of RAM, we'll just type in 2048 and here we would type in divided by 2, so 1024. That would assign 2 gigabytes. Now if we would want to go up higher for example 8 gigabytes even I run on 16 gigabytes I assign 4 that seem to be work uh, or seem to work nicely for me so if you want to go with 8 gigabytes even you could go with 8192 and here we need um, half of it so 4096 right yes so now I would assign 8 gigabytes. Let's leave it like that. Next step, you need to find out where your Minecraft launcher exe is positioned. Uh, in most cases it should be on the desktop. If you want to find out, make sure it's not the jar file, it is the launcher. Okay, that is important. So click on properties if you don't know where it is and um, there you have your location. Copy that and paste it in here and then just add Minecraft exe just like you see it here but as I said I will copy and copy that thing to the um, video description and you can take it from there but make sure to adjust you know put in the right links otherwise it won't work you will probably not use docm77 as your username when you're done with that just uh, click on save as that is important save as not just save and now name it um, I'll call it test now and make sure to add dot bat so you save it as a batch file save and there we go we have our batch file and if you look um, at its content we see this contains the uh, command line we just made all right so and now it's really simple if you want to start uh, minecraft just double click on your batch file and it opens up Minecraft and you can play it and if you'll start it and check with F3 you'll see you have the, um, no, uh, yeah, the size of memory allocated you chose here in your batch file and that's it that's how you do it super simple really really easy to do um, everybody should be able to replicate that and if you do it like that if you point to the launcher and not to the jar file um, it should work easily for everybody so that's basically it. I hope you liked that quick guide here. I'm sure um, many of you people could try it out and see if it uh, yeah, brings any success, uh, if it prevents any crashes and stuff or maybe improves performance. I would be interested in that to hear from a wider audience if that thing uh, helps uh, f um, for the FPS especially because it's controversial. I'm not sure. I felt it helped a bit. But let me know. would be much appreciated. And that's it for today. I'm out. Bye. Bye.